Are you able to solve this horrible equation? Inspection is always, always, always our first step. Now, have a look at the denominators. 2023, 2024, this year, and 2025, next year. What about the numerators? x minus 2, x, which is x plus 0, and x plus 2. So a kind of symmetry is hidden in our equation. So what shall we do? The left-hand side is still so complicated. It also doesn't matter if we have a look at the right-hand side. Have a look at the right-hand side, 6. Hmm. So the idea is we can separate this 6 into three twos. What do I mean? This six can be written as two plus two plus two. And it can be separated into three twos. And our left hand side has just three terms. Wow. So what can we do? We can give each term a two. So now, firstly, give this term a 2. So that will be minus 2, because it's on the left hand side, plus x over 2024 minus 2, and then plus x minus 2, oh sorry, x plus 2 here, over 2025 minus 2 and 0. So these two equations are equivalent. Now let's calculate. Here is x minus 2 minus 2 times 2023 over 2023. Here we have x minus 2 times 2024 over 2024. Here we have x plus 2, but then minus 2 times 2025, then all over 2025 is 0. Now, if you have a look at the numerators, you will find out that they are all equal to x minus 4048. So now, if their numerators are equal, what can we do then? It's just x minus 4048, then times 1 over 2023 plus 1 over 2024 plus 1 over 2025 equals 0. So now, because this one is positive, the sum of three positive numbers is of course positive. However, the multiplication, the product of two terms equals 0, but one of them is positive. So that means this implies x minus 2024 has to be 0. And x is just 4048. So that's the answer. You can plug it in and check if this is correct. Of course, it is correct. Did you get it? Did you get the trick? Did you get the method? Give me a thumbs up. Give this video a like. Please subscribe to me for more wonderful questions and math videos. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.